Hey guys, today we're going to do a changing video with the littlest sweetheart and we're going to do a haul and I might give you a little de more details about her than I did in the box opening, okay? So first we're going to do our haul. So the first thing we have is a little giraffe and I bought him in a, a confinement store. And he was like 99 cents. And then the next thing I bought was a little blanket. It has Pooh Bear on it in different places. And it has different color flowers. And it's pink because I don't have a whole lot of blankets for my babies yet. Then I also got this little pillow. And it has a sheep on it on the side of it because I don't have I have three babies now but I don't have but two pillows so I got this one this one today for one of them and then I got this for the for the littlest sweetheart I had a had some string on it I know I'm not going to name her Blakely but um this was the one that I found to go under her clothes and then I found this little onesie for um, little Grace that I got last week and I'm gonna put under her clothes and then the last thing I got just picked up at Walmart and it's a little sleeper and it has little koalas on it and uh, black hearts and purple purple leaves and pink leaves and a purple flower and pink flowers and mint green leaves and mint green around the top and that's all for the haul guys so i'll bring it around put it over here out of the way then i'm gonna scoot her over here oh i forgot to get her onesie out there we go. I'm going to put that up under her clothes. And what we're going to put on her today is this little onesie that has Make Every Day Magical with a little unicorn. And it has little pants and it has a little bow. And we're going to put her a modified pink silicone pussy in. And pink socks. I'll unfold them so you guys can see. Little pink socks. And we are going to put her on a diaper today. Okay. So here we go. I'll just get her undressed. And she has... Um, Velcro in the back, so I'm just going to undo it, and I'll tell you some of my, her details as I unclothe her. Ooh, that's a little tight. She does have some, uh, little coloring on her elbow, and she does have armatures where you can pose her arms. And she has coloring on this arm as, on this elbow as well. And then she come with a little cloth diaper that we're going to take off of it. We're going to put a real diaper on her. And her legs are not jointed. They're just kind of floppy. And her little feet are wrinkled on the bottom, and this foot is scrunched up. And that little foot is wrinkled as well. And she's got little wrinkles on her legs. And her mouth, her mouth is open, so she will take a modified passy. She's got something on her face. We'll have to get that off. And then she does have 
which I forgot to do last night during the unboxing. She does have rooted hair. As you can see, I forgot to take her knitting off and let you guys see her rooted hair. But that's her details. I'm going to go ahead and take her diaper off. And I'm going to put her clothes on. Okay. So we have this diaper. It's a one, so it might be a little big for her. Because she is a smaller petite doll. So I'll have to get... I'll have to get some smaller diapers. Yeah, it's going to be a little big. But that's okay. It'll do for now. Okay. And next, we're going to put on the sleeper that I bought. I didn't really want to get the one that had a name on it or a long sleeve, but that's all I could find for now. And I like for them to wear onesies just because different clothes or different sizes and it will show their cloth body under their clothes and i don't like that so i just put a onesie a tight uh onesie up under it so you can just see the onesie instead of their their cloth bodies so She's a little hard to get dressed because of her open hands, but we'll get it. Let's see if we can. There we go. That's a little better. That hand's open, but it's kind of, it's kind of scrunched. So it's not as fully opened as the other one. So, I'm sorry I'm moving her around. Okay, let's see. And this one was a newborn, and I bought it at a confinement store. So, I'm hoping it'll be small enough for her. Because I'm hoping the outfit that I have for her over here fits, because it's also a newborn. But it looks a little big. So, we shall see. Here's our onesie. And put this on over her head. Here we go. Now I'm gonna see if I can't get it in on, on yeah, much much better than the long sleeve. Of course that long sleeve is gonna show, but that'll be okay for now. Okay, these are, if I didn't tell you and you didn't watch um, my haul where I got them, they're from Gerber and they're newborn. So the newborn is a little big on the Lilla Sweetheart, just a little bit there. See about the pants, see how they're going to look on her. Let's see here. It's going to cover up magical. Uh-oh, it's going to cover up our unicorn. Maybe not. Maybe we can do it like that. Okay. All right. Now we're going to put on her socks. These socks might be a little big. I think they're zero to three. They're about the only thing I have. I've got to go shopping for some smaller socks. But they're just not easy to find except for online. And then you can't really tell how small they are. So, that's my dilemma on socks, guys. But they seem to fit her okay for now. And then we're going to set her up. We bought our brush. I'm going to brush her hair because, oh my, it's got messy back there, hasn't huh? it, sweetie? There we go. Brush it good. And then we'll put her bow on. It's going to be a big bow for such a little girl. 
but it's going to work. There we go. Well, I may have to find a different bow because that one looks a little big for this baby. But we'll scoot it back a little bit. That way maybe you can see her face. And then we'll put her posse in. There we go. And her outfit is complete. So, um, yeah, guys, the newborns are a little big on her. So I might have to do something else. Um, especially the bow. Didn't expect the bow to be that large since it was on a um, newborn baby. But uh, I will find her a different bow and put on her. Not right now, but later. And then, uh, so there is our uh, little sweetheart. So the last thing that I have is I have a name reveal. I'm going to name her Layla. So her name is going to be Layla. So here everyone is Layla in her new outfit. Thanks guys for watching. Bye.